Mike, can I just get your thoughts on the main event between Ilya and Max? That's a hard fight for both. If he's going to be on the stand-up, it will be hard. But if Ilya uses his background and Jiu-Jitsu and wrestling, I think Ilya can win the much easier. Ah, mate, it's going to be a stealth fight. You know, I'm excited for it. I, I find it very hard to tip against Max at any time, just because it's Max, right? But Ori would have to be his hardest challenge to date, I reckon, to boy his skill set. It's probably the, I reckon, probably the, the highest caliber in the division at the moment, you know. So, yeah, we'll have to wait and see. Like I said, hard to tip against Max, but to Boris, no one thought he could do what he did last. Well, I like both. I mean, this is the third time uh, fighting with Max on the same card. Uh, uh, I know him better than Ilya, but uh, I really... It can go back and forward, you know. There are some stats, like uh, Max never been knocked out, and uh, Ilya has a very good boxing. Uh, of course, he's a mixed martial artist, so uh, I really cannot answer this question. I'm very excited by myself. Ilya in this fight, and how do you think the fight's going to go on? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, as I've been saying, uh, both incredible fighters, both incredible, uh, incredible athletes. They are both, obviously both like to use their hands, but they do things differently. You know, Max is, uh, you know, you know he, he works a game plan, he could work it for the five rounds, his gas tank, his chin. Uh, he probably used to rely on his chin more, where now he's a lot more defensive, which he's going to need with someone like Ilya, because uh, as I said, you know, we, we all know Ilya can crack. Uh, but I think that's what it will come down to, that, that experience. Again, Ilya is a, he's a great fighter. Um, he might obviously go out there and do his thing and surprise us in the five rounds. Uh, but as you said, with Max, he's had so many, uh, you must have forgot, uh, moments. You know, he's been in so many big fights and proven himself so many times. So I'm, that's why I'm going to have to back uh, Max, just knowing how many times he's, he's proven that. Uh, Ilya might show us something. Uh, and then, you know, we won't be uh, thinking that ever again. But right now, I, I think Max can take him into deep waters. And I don't know if I've seen uh, Ilya there. So it's going to be interesting. We'll see what... Uh, this is going to be unfam unfamiliar sort of territory for, uh, for Ilya if it goes in them later rounds, especially with someone like Max. Uh, we'll see how he takes that. If he gets through that with flying colours, you know he's a real deal. I'm 50-50. I change my opinion every two minutes, but... If I had to go with one, I believe Taporia because he's just on he's just on a run at the minute, but he can't bet against Max Holloway either. So yeah, man, I'm just I just want to see the fight as a fan. Uh, I mean, he he's had a fast rise. I I think he's really good. You know, he's a champ for a reason. I don't think there's any flukes. You know, people will say, well, you know, if Volk fought too soon, no, he beat Volk and uh, he beat a lot of good guys on the way. He beat Emmett in a five round barn burner and. Um, He's he's skilled, man. He can fight. He could take the fight anywhere on the ground, on you know, on the feet, on the ground. He has one punch knockout power, um, and it, he just seems to be just in tune of what he's doing. You know, um, I think him and I would make a great fight one day. You know, but yeah. Дэнни вопрос, если можешь проговори, как ты думаешь про главное событие на этом карде? Max Holloway против Ильи Тупори. Какие у тебя ощущения по этому бою? Это очень интересный бой. Очень тяжело сказать, кто выиграет. Но я думаю, что Топория выиграет. You know, it's a very interesting fight. It's very hard to predict who's going to win. But I think it's going to be Топория. The last one for me. Can I get your thoughts on the main event between Ilya and Max? Последний вопрос. Что ты думаешь насчет главного события между Топория и Халлоуэм? Мое мнение, что Илья Тапурия очень набрал большой ход и его будет очень тяжело остановить. Мне кажется, он будет победителем с этого боя. Холловей, он немного разгоняется и в третьем-четвертом раунде он может показать лучшее выступление, чем в первых двух. Но в первых двух раундах Тапурия очень опасен. И я склоняюсь там, Холовой очень хороший боец, но я склоняюсь к тому, что э, Тапурия выйдет победителем. You know, when you talk about the main event, when it comes to Tapuria, I feel like he's on such a 
huge pace up, right? He's, he's going up and up and up really, really quick, and he's got a crazy amount of skills, and it's going to be really hard to stop him, right? So I, I'm, I'm leaning towards Ilya. I, I love Holloway. I think he's a great fighter, but I think it takes him a little bit of time to kind of warm up and get into the groove. Uh, maybe third, fourth round is great for, for Holloway, but the first two rounds to Poria is most dangerous, so it's something that's going to be really hard for, for Holloway to get over that. И твои мысли насчет главного события между Максом и Ильей? Макс мне очень сильно импонирует как боец. Я давно за ним слежу. Ну и Тапурия, конечно, безусловно, очень ярко себя проявляет сейчас. Ну, не знаю. Я думаю, будет очень красивый, красочный бой. Я хочу, чтобы просто победил сильнейший. You know, I'm a big fan of Max. I've, uh, I've been following Max for a long time, following his career. I think that he's, uh, he's a great fighter. I also really like uh, Tapuri. You know, he's, uh, he's, he's pushing forward. He's got a lot of hype behind him, a lot of speed. So uh, I think that uh, it's going to be a wonderful fight, and hopefully the, the strongest wins.